hello everyone welcome back to the channel this is the lord diary my name is achayo uh, today we are cooking and eating uh, popo uh, we call it quarry actually this is one of the most forgotten sauce uh, that our grandfathers and, and grandmothers used to eat but only few of us these days knows that we can actually cook and eat popo So if you are getting a uh, popo for cooking, uh, you get the ones that are not yet ripened or that are almost, um, but you get the ones that are not yet ready, yeah, that are not yet ready because if you get the ones that are ready, uh, it will be sweet, the taste will be sweet and we don't really want that sweetness, eh? we want to taste uh, the real taste of food but not uh, of fruit. That's why we get the ones that are not yet very ready. So please stay with me as I take you through uh, the processes of cooking this. We are going to cook this with silver fish. We call it lachede. Just to give it a nice, a nice taste. We can actually cook this with fish or we can even cook this uh, yeah, with meat. Yeah, depending on uh, what you want to cook it with. Or you can even just eat it like that. Uh, some people even uh, cook it with sim sim. Uh, we call it la koro koro. Mm. You, you can cook it in whatever way. But uh, in this case, we are going to cook it with silver fish. We are going to cook this with lachede. So after after cutting it into cubes, uh, we wash it thoroughly. 
with clean water. We can wash it like more than two times. The purpose of doing this is to uh, is to is to get rid of the bitterness because it produces uh, that milk that is bitter. And uh, so after washing, we sand dry it just like for thirty minutes only, only to get rid of that bitterness of which we don't really want that. Uh, we don't want to test the bitterness in our foods. That is why we put it uh, to wilt a bit under the sun. So we are starting cooking now. Uh, we are frying this with uh, shea butter. Eh? It's like not real cooking oil, but we are using shea butter. It's so organic. It's so natural. It tastes so good. Uh, so we are getting uh, our lachede done. We are washing. And then we start the process of cooking. So please watch every step. Don't miss. So you also learn how we cook popo. Uh, um, being unnaturally, we have uh, various clans uh, among our tribe. Uh, basically, from mine, uh, we call it uh, we call it papai. Yeah, but uh, for today, I am here in Paton, in Nagago district, uh, and these people they call it tuku. Eh? But uh, from our side, tuku uh, tuku is something else, not uh, not not popo, uh, but for them they call this they, they call this tuku. Okay. Meanwhile, for us, we call it papai. Kindly let me know how you call this in your uh, in your local language, because uh, where I come from, uh, we call it uh, we call it papai. But here in Paton, they call it tuku. Please let me know how you call popo in your local language in the comment section.
here guys so food is ready i wish you could really come and take uh just take a little of this uh popo and you have a taste of it thank you so much for being with me thank you so much for watching please let me know in the comment section uh what you think of our food uh do they really eat this kind of food in your homes or in your village or among your clans and how do you call this because uh for us here we call it quarry uh some clans call it tuko let me know in the comment section what you think of our food or if you've ever eaten this food before thank you so much make sure you're subscribed to the channel uh, comment uh, giving you views also share the video thank you so much bye bye